welcome back good morning it's a beautiful sunday morning and the weather here in coimbatore is just perfect so me and reeves thought we would take a ride to the fields just explore the neighborhood come back home and make a yummy sunday brunch i'm going to make full english breakfast today and show you guys as well how to make a full english breakfast at home let's go Surrounded by beautiful mountains and ravishing fields, I live in a scenic neighborhood. We just love to spend our weekends in the fields. After a tiring work week Monday to Friday, spending some time in the fields or even taking a ride along the fields is so relaxing for us. We either go around in the evenings to watch the sunset or in the mornings for that fresh breeze. and the smell of those grassy fields with the dew drops on it no words for me to describe it i just love 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 it there is something so satisfying about growing your own vegetables i used to tell reeves let's get a small piece of farmland and grow some veggies fruits and flowers it's pure bliss right this passion for slow sustainable living was inside me and when i moved here I just realized this is where I belong. I hope someday we get our own field and even raise some goats. This little guy is so adorable. In my 27, I just realized happiness in life is just in small little things. Now I just want to dive into the water, but it's so deep and not doing it today, but next time planning to. The place was so scenic and beautiful. We don't want to leave so soon so we sat here for a bit and as usual had some funny conversations and started back home. So you lost you can never forget. When you look into my eyes. Someone is waiting for breakfast and it's April Frisky, my beagle girl. Enough of sniffing, let me in. Got to make breakfast. Breakfast time. Today's breakfast is traditional full English breakfast. I will tell you guys how to make full English breakfast at home. If you haven't tried it at home, you should definitely cook this. It's a feast and so comforting. Traditional full English breakfast has some toast, mashed potatoes, baked beans, sausages, eggs cooked to your choice like scrambled, sunny side up or fried, some grilled tomatoes, mushrooms and also bacon. I don't like bacon so not including it today. So yeah, let's begin. First, let's make our mashed potatoes. Cut 2 to 3 potatoes and pressure cook them. The potatoes must cook well nice and soft without any lumps so pressure cook them with some salt for 6 to 7 whistles so you love you can never forget when you look into my eyes i'm adding a bit of rock salt here let it cook meanwhile let's prepare other components For making full English breakfast, we need some bread slices, sausages, mushrooms, baked beans. I'm using Del Monte brand. I'll link in the description below. You can check it out. And some tomatoes and some eggs. Let's toast the bread. Add little butter to the pan and toast the bread slices. Once done, transfer it to the plate. 
Next, to the same pan, add a bit of oil and grill the sausages. Today I am using smoked chicken sausage. It was really delicious, some new brand I guess. I will link it down in the description, you can check it out. It will take roughly 5 or 4-5 or five minutes to cook the sausages. I am adding a bit of pepper powder. It's already seasoned but still I add a bit of pepper powder. Once done, transfer it to the plate and add a bit of oil to the same pan. Next, let's grill our mushrooms. Season them with some salt and pepper powder. I am also adding this mixed herb seasoning to it. It has oregano, basil and other herbs. It's really good. Mushrooms will take about 6 to 8 minutes to cook. Once done, transfer it to the plate. Next, in the same pan, we are going to grill some tomatoes. Season the tomatoes with some salt and grill them. Once done, transfer it to the plate. By this time, our potatoes will be cooked. Once the pressure settles, peel the potatoes and bring them back to the pan and mash them well with the back of the fork. Mash them well with some butter until there are no lumps left. Usually you have to pass this mashed potatoes through a strainer to remove the lumps if any but that's time consuming and this is quite quick. Next add a good amount of hot milk to the potatoes. The milk should be hot and this is when you need to switch on the stove. Combine the potatoes well in the milk and add more milk if required. The potatoes will absorb how much of a milk you add. So 1 to 2 cups of milk will be sufficient for 2 to 3 potatoes. Let's take the pan off the stove. Add a good amount of butter. Adding butter at this point makes your mashed potatoes just yum. Season with some salt, pepper powder and oregano or any other herbs in hand. This mashed potatoes is absolute heaven. Try it, you will know. And yeah, our creamy mashed potatoes is done. Next, let's make our baked beans. For that, to a pan, add a bit of oil and add the baked beans. As I mentioned, I'm using this Del Monte brand. It's really delicious. I'll link it below, you can check it out. So we have to season the baked beans with some salt, some pepper powder and some herbs. As usual, I'm using this mixed herb seasoning. You can also use oregano if you have in hand. So combine well, that's it. Our baked beans is ready. Finally, we are going to make our eggs. Reeves wanted his eggs to be scrambled and so me. Sometimes we have sunny side up but today we are sticking with scrambled. Always turn off the stove before seasoning your eggs. It's actually a tip from Gordon Ramsay. Yeah. So seasoning with some salt, some pepper powder and some herbs. Give it a mix and transfer it to the plate. Now we are all done. It, it's time for plating. Here goes my toast, my sausages, tomatoes, mushrooms, mashed potatoes and baked beans. Finally, our eggs. Breakfast is ready. Did you see who is eagerly waiting for it? I was explaining you in detail on how to make this full English breakfast at home. It doesn't take much time. It's actually quite easy to make it. So try this out. If you do, don't forget to tag me in Instagram. I would love to see your creation. It was really a beautiful Sunday morning today in the fields. And this yummy breakfast platter is just perfect. I'm so grateful. Happiness is enjoying little things in life, right? Let's not miss that out. Hope you enjoyed watching this video. Oops, I forgot. And this is April enjoying a sausage. Did you see that reaction? She is 24 bar 7 only thinking about food. 
typical beagle thing thanks for watching till the end keep supporting by subscribing to the channel see you next week bye happy sunday